Hungary. What do you know about Hungary? Budapest? Lake Balaton? Palinka? Thermal baths? Yachts in the Mediterranean? Wait, what? Yachts in the Mediterranean? Yes, you are hearing right. Hungary is also a country where the Prime Minister flies private jets to see his favourite football team play. And oligarchs gather at luxury yachts registered abroad to talk business. You would expect to read about it in the media, but they don't say anything. And when they do, George Soros somehow ends up being the bad guy in the story. Soros. 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 Actually, that is not entirely true. Although the state controls a significant part of the Hungarian media, there are a few exceptions. Like we at Adlatso. We are one of the last surviving independent investigative organizations in Hungary that covers everything shady that goes on in the country. Like the time Hungary contracted the Russians to build a nuclear power plant on an earthquake zone. Or the time when the government spent tens of millions on an anti-EU campaign, yet it continues to get rich on EU funds. Did you know that the Hungarian Minister of Foreign Affairs managed the crisis in Belarus from a luxury yacht in the Adriatic while posing on Facebook in an office environment wearing a suit? We have produced over 10,000 stories, 450 videos, filed or facilitated more than 18,000 freedom of information requests and won dozens of lawsuits. The government is doing everything to limit or completely stop activities of organizations like Atlatso. And you can bet there are plenty of other European leaders who are wondering whether they could get away with the same thing. Supporting and empowering organizations like Atlatso helps to promote transparency, accountability, and freedom of information in Europe. Follow Atlatso and stay informed.